Japan wants mix of F-22 plus F-35 hybrid fighter. Japan and Lockheed Martin are reportedly discussing the creation of a hybrid F-22 and F-35 fighter aircraft to protect Japanese airspace. The design would incorporate the F-22 and F-35 and could be superior to both of them, a source told Reuters. According to the news outlet, Lockheed is awaiting approval from the U.S. government to offer sensitive details about the Pentagon's latest and greatest technology. Although Japan has put forward notional Raptor-like designs, what they could also be talking about here is merging the higher kinematic performance and low observability of the F-22 with the F-35's smarter attributes, including updated avionics, mission computers, and sensors, as well as new lower maintenance skin coatings. The Japanese $366 million Mitsubishi X-2 technology demonstrator took its final flight last year after a relatively short life. Apparently, technical difficulties impacted the program and it was clear that Japan would need a deep foreign partnership in order to field a stealth fighter that could also benefit Japanese industry. But now a $40 billion tender is being put forward by Japan to indigenously develop or import a new super fighter design. Although Mitsubishi's X-2 technology demonstrator has just taken flight, it is just that, a technology demonstrator. Despite inaccurate press reports that the X-2 is a prototype, there's is no guarantee it will make it into production in the coming decade. The future of Japan's next-generation fighter jet program remains murky. We are considering domestic development, joint development and the possibility of improving existing aircraft performance, a Japanese defense ministry spokesman said April, but we have not come to any decision yet. Japan's current fleet of F-15J and F-2 aircraft are based on decades-old designs modeled off Boeing's F-15 and Lockheed's F-16, respectively. The Japanese government is seeking to replace aircraft that melds together the F-22 Raptor and the F-35 Lightning. The proposed aircraft would combine the F-22 and F-35 and could be superior to both of them. Lockheed Martin stands ready as always to build more and we look forward to exploring options for Japan's F-2 replacement fighter in cooperation with both the Japanese and U.S. governments. The USAF is finally looking at restarting the Raptor production line, but the chances of that happening are almost nil, because doing so would directly challenge the F-35 program. And although the F-22 is the only existing fighter that can actually fulfill Japan's $40 billion tender, it will likely be shot down by Lockheed, the USAF and Congress. Meanwhile, Japan is already an F-35 customer, with 42 of the jets on order. What's also new is that the USAF has completed a study that looked into what it would cost to put an updated F-22 back into production. But if Japan is willing to buy an updated Raptor instead of developing a near-identical but still unique design, clearly doing so would present a mutually beneficial opportunity. If the US would become a minority stakeholder in an F-22 production line restart of sorts, with the intent on buying a number of airframes to bolster the USAF's undersized and cherished F-22 fleet, then the opportunity could work out for both parties. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.